And in this video, I will show you how to get, download, and install Showmax on your smart TV. So, over here, I have the Hisense Vida Smart TV, but it doesn't really matter the TV you're using. So, whether it's a Samsung TV, an LG TV, a Sony TV, whatever TV you're using, this is going to work pretty well for you. We'll be looking at three different ways to get the Showmax app into our smart TV, and I'll be showing you how to basically go about it on any smart TV that you're using. Now, on the first method of getting the Showmax app into our smart TV, you want to first of all go to the app store of your smart TV, check if the Showmax app is there, and then download it directly from that particular platform. So, what you want to go ahead and do is to just go to the app store of your smart TV. In my case, you can basically see my app store over here, and this is the Vida app store. So, you just want to go ahead and open the app store of your smart tv whether it's an android tv just go ahead and open up the app store and then on the top search bar of your smart tv you just want to go ahead and search for show marks just at the top bar and once you're done typing you can just go ahead and search for the show marks app and if your tv actually has show marks app you're definitely going to see it on your tv just like so and you can now go ahead and either open the application or just download it into your smart tv but even though you do not have it on your TV, it is not really a problem because you can now proceed to watch the other solution I am going to offer in this particular video. Now, if you have it on your TV, you just want to go ahead and click on it and you should be able to download and start streaming videos from your Showmax app. If the first option did not work for you, another thing you might want to try is to stream Showmax directly from the browser on your TV. Now, most of the recent tvs we have these days usually come with browser and this allows you to do a couple of things on your tv without necessarily having those apps now for instance you can see the browser option on my tv over here and i also have the browser um, option on the remote control so i can just go ahead and open up the browser on my tv just like so and on the search bar you just want to go ahead and search for show marks on your search bar now the showmax app is going to load on your tv and what you just want to go ahead and do is to click on the first option which takes you directly to the showmax website where you can now sign in and even watch movies directly from the website so in, in this case i can now go ahead like so click on the sign in button just at the top like so and i can also start streaming showmax directly from this particular browser Trust me, this works very fast and very smooth that you may not even notice that you do not have the native Showmax app on your TV. Finally, if the first and the second option did not work out for you, then you might consider using a TV box, particularly a Google Chromecast. Now, if you do not know what a Google Chromecast is, it basically looks like this. And the purpose of this particular device is to give you an Android environment that enables you to be able to download and install android apps into your smart tv this particular device is very cheap and very affordable i'm going to leave a link in the description of this video where you can get it from amazon at an affordable price so you can just go ahead and get it and once you get this device it has um, a hdmi dongle and what you just want to do is to plug it to any of the hdmi ports on your tv now once it, it is plugged to your tv you can just click on the input button on your tv just like so and you just have to select the hdmi ports where this device is plugged and automatically it gives you that android environment that enables you to now be able to find any app that is available on the google play store and what that means is that you can now download and watch show marks directly from this particular device now this is basically the best option even if your tv is a non-smart tv or it's a smart tv it works absolutely well and it is the most recommended solution if your tv does not have the native show marks app and it doesn't have a browser for you to be able to stream it online that will be all on today's video guys if this video was able to help you get show marks into your smart tv or to be able to watch show marks still on your tv then make sure you smash that like button and subscribe to this youtube channel for more interesting tech tips like this one